Jobstreet.com, Singapore Slingers had their backs against the wall last Tuesday as they faced a must-win situation against the Indonesia Warriors in their final game of the season. The Slingers need a win just to keep their postseason hopes alive, but they faced the tough task of defeating the visiting Warriors who handed them a loss just four days earlier. And, off the tip, it goes out of bounds. and it's Stan Pringle who gets Indonesia on the scoreboard first, early in the game. But Mitchell Folkoff is able to tip the long rebound to himself and he ties it up at four. Long way long on a scoop. Shot Singleton with a big quarter for the Slingers and he helps them take a 13 to 6 lead late in the first. But the Warriors close out the quarter on a 9-2 run as they lead it 15-13 after one. Indonesia continues to pour it on in the second as Chris Daniels streaks in for the alley-oop. That increases the Warrior lead to seven. Steve Thomas working inside the paint. He gets the basket and draws the foul. Indonesia take their biggest lead of the game at 10. They're playing extremely hard. Uh, we've turned the ball over far too many times, and so we'll have to uh, regroup for the second half. But I expect the Slingers to come out and play extremely hard. They're well coached, and um, I think we'll be in for a very tight game in the second half. Jennings unable to return in the second half, so it was up to Singleton to carry the load as he continues to dominate in the paint. Philip Morrison with 17 points and four steals on the night as he takes this one all the way in for the score. They manage to cut the Warrior lead to three. But without Jennings on the inside, Thomas takes control of the paint and the defending champions lead it by eight, heading into the fourth. Singapore not ready to call it quits just yet as Singleton catches the pass inside for the flush, cutting the lead back down to seven. But Indonesia turning up the defense in the fourth as Jarek Kanyada quickly gets ahead for the score. He finishes with 12 points on the night. A 12-point performance from Stan Pringle as well as he looks to have his legs back right in time for the first round. Stan Pringle scoring in track. Another easy flush the other way for Rashad Singleton as he posts a game-high 23 points, Warrior lead back down to 7. But Indonesia is able to hold off the fourth quarter charge as they crush any remaining hopes of a Slinger playoff appearance by handing them a 63-53 loss on their home court. Chris Daniels with 15 points and 21 rebounds as the Warriors head into the first round on a three-game winning streak. Unfortunately for Rashad Singleton and the Slingers, they have reached the end of their season. First and foremost, I just want to thank my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for allowing me to come out here and play the game I love. Uh, it was an emotional game, you know, tough season. Battled with a few injuries and whatnot, but uh, overall, I'm proud of my team. We showed a lot of a fight tonight, uh, especially compared to the last game. So that was uh, uh, our main objective, just to come out with a lot more energy, uh, a lot more passion, and just give the fans uh, a show and let them know that we appreciate it. The Warriors, I mean, so-called one of the best uh, a defensive team, I think um, they deserve it. 